Hey guys, welcome to another Reaper blog tutorial. In this video, I'll show you two different ways you can hide unused, unwanted, or broken effects from your effects browser so you never add them to your project accidentally ever again. Let's start off in Reaper's preferences. Added in Reaper 515 is this option to filter out specific plugins, such as the auto unit plugins from Waves. Uh, they prefer that you use the VST3 plugins, uh, at least on OS 10. So this is filtered by default. I would like to get rid of the Apple plugins that come with GarageBand. So I'm going to paste in not audio unit Apple and not audio unit instrument Apple. Hit apply. And now those plugins are missing from my list. So I will undo that, take those away, hit apply, refresh this. There's audio unit MIDI synth, sampler, don't want those. The next way we can filter out plugins is by renaming an effect with this symbol, the hashtag, the pound sign. Just rename your effect with this symbol in it. And then you want to click in any the unused area of the effects browser or go up to the options menu, show an effects list, and plugins that begin with that symbol, pound sign, hashtag, click that and those ones will disappear. Two different ways to filter out effects that are unwanted, broken, whatever. Um, you don't want to use them. You don't want to see them. There you go. There's two ways you can get rid of them. Hope you've enjoyed this tutorial. Thanks a lot for watching. Please subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Facebook and Twitter. Support the videos with a Patreon donation. And visit reaperblog.net for a lot more tutorials.